Well, Julius, LSC, Australian company based in Melbourne. They gave us clarity. They gave us the minimum and the maximum. And now they give us the mantra light. And they've been giving since the late 70s when I was in lighting. Yeah. Wow. When when you started in lighting. I started in the mid to early 70s, Jimmy. Well, the... How old were you then? I wasn't even born, mate. Um, Which makes me uh, an excellent person to talk about this. Now, this is a cute little thing. Um, uh, And I believe the the working uh, theory behind this was they wanted to build a lighting console that plumbers could use. (laughs) You didn't know that, did you? Um, and I think I think they've succeeded. This is this is fantastically simple to use and operate. We've got 24 fixture faders, and a fixture can be you know, a, a standard incandescent dimmer channel, or it can be an LED fixture, or it can be a moving light. There's a built-in library and there's a built-in fixture editor. Uh, and if you're not sure what your fixture parameters are, you can use the fixture editor and just push faders up and down, and then pick what the fixture is doing on the screen in response and it'll generate the profile. Hmm. Really cool. That's good. Um, it's super easy to use if you want to, for instance, you know, turn on some lights and set them as a color. I'll just go back to the home screen, push up some faders and we can choose the lights. Hmm. And then we've got these little app screens. Yeah. So we can go in, we've got our color picker. Um, and when you pick a color, it adds it to the recent palette. Uh, there's easy ways to do things like fanning. So you can go, for instance, fan, and then you can draw a line, and that's just picked a fan yeah. based on the, the fixtures that we have selected. The, the, the GUI's it's, really good. They've, it's really they've cool. Hired, they've hired an artist. There's an undo feature. Mm. We've got our home, and just keep pressing, and you go back to the home screen. Something I like is um, if you go power down, it has a little UPS yeah, in it. Yeah, how um, cool is that? Which And you see it just do the little save thing before it shuts down. Yeah, and we actually tried this. Julius unceremoniously just yanked the power lead out when I told him about this. I said, there's a UPS. He's really pulled the power lead out and it saves your show and then it does a safe shutdown, mm. which is uh, very cool. And it's, it's not unnecessarily in case Julius comes to your show, but also if you get Bran out or whatever, it's going to uh, it's gonna cover you nicely for that. Mm. Look, I think this is a very nicely executed product. Um, it's, I suppose, sort of that next level up from, from you know, the very basic console. Uh, you know, it does control movement. It's got things like movement effects and so on. And really, you know, if you're not too up on, on wanting to learn how to drive a lighting console specifically, mm. this is going to be a pretty good option. So how many fixtures again? Up to 24. Yeah, I think that's that's right on the money, isn't it? I think, yeah. And look, I think especially where given the price point it sits in, this is this is exactly what it needs to be.